Juan Francisco Manzano was born in Havana, Cuba in 1797. He was born a slave but did not truly understand his status until the death of his first mistress, Donna Beatriz Justice. His second mistress was Marquesa Ameno. During his time with Marquesa Ameno, he was beaten and punished for even the slightest infringements. He was quoted as saying, I was my mistress's lapdog since I had to follow her wherever she went. He remained a slave until the age of 40 in 1837. In 1844, Manzano was implicated in a high treason trial. Juan Francisco Manzano died in either 1853 or 1854. A slightly recent biography was written by Margarita Ingle and illustrated by Sean Qualls. It won an award and was titled The Poet Slave of Cuba. The book itself was written in poetic format and depicts how Juan Francisco Manzano became the poet we know today, starting with his early childhood. His early childhood was spent with Dona Beatriz. During his time under her ownership, he developed his skills as a writer. His prowess expanded as he grew older. He published many works throughout his lifetime, some of which include Flores Pasajeros in 1830, Zephira, a drama published in 1842. His autobiography translated to English in 1840 and a collection of poems in 1820. A few of his poems were included in his autobiography. His poems have been translated to German, French, and English. Juan Francisco Manzano's original poems are in Spanish because that is his native language. Manzano writes in free verse, but seems to have no identifiable meter. This is most likely because he taught himself how to read and write and probably wasn't familiar with the components of poetry. Despite being uneducated, Juan Francisco Manzano is an excellent poet.